let's see how this actually works in action. So I'm going to add myself as a contact and I'm just going to put in my personal phone number. That's it. So we'll go here, tag start bot, and boom. So in this one on the SMS AI configuration tab, I have it where it sends the initial outreach, which is going to include the image. And then I have it to where it's going to send the voice message as well. All right, so the bot has been initiated now and you can see the image is customized with the lead's first name and the audio file. Hey Jordan, this is, is Elon too. Musk. Funny enough, I'm a product of agent centrics AI. It allows you to. And for this, we have Elon Musk just for fun, just for this demo. So let's reply to the bot. So we are going to reply interesting. And the, what the bot's going to do is it's going to begin to go down the qualifying questions to make sure that this lead, AKA me, fits the criteria for someone who can become a client of ours. And then once it does that, and once it's confirmed with those qualifying questions that this lead is in fact qualified to buy, then we are going to book the appointment, which is the objective that we set in the portal. So now we're getting into the qualifying questions. So do we currently use any AI tools in our agency? Yeah, we use the conversational AI that's provided in Go High Level, which by the way costs five cents for every message sent, and we do not charge tokens. That's great. How many sublocations are you currently managing with Go High Level's conversational AI? Let's say seven. So don't mind this first message. This is actually a notification that's sent to the agency users or the agency admin to let them know that a conversation has been analyzed and it seems to be a hot lead or a conversation that seems to be going somewhere. So in this instance, this wouldn't be sending to me as the lead. The reason it's sending to me is because I am the agency's admin. So this wouldn't be here. So that's a good number. Do you think using AI tools like ours can help you differentiate from competitors? And so I'm gonna come back they're a little abrasive. What do you mean? What AI tools do you have? And this is where the bot is gonna pull from all that contextual data that's put into the portal with the qualifying questions, the FAQs, the about my company, the additional prompting to be able to answer questions and objections and FAQs just like this one right here. So I've set the time a little bit faster here too and I'm going to uh, speed through the wait times. Usually it's set at a 30 second wait time for communication. That's more of just the natural conversational Time frame, and it also allows for message queuing. So if someone sends multiple messages in a row, instead of sending three messages back, we're able to reply to all three messages with just one reply. So we have advanced AI chatbots capable of arranging schedules, managing pipelines. We also offer AI generated hyper personalized voice messages using voice cloning, AI driven image generation for highly customized communication strategies. And all these tools are designed to help you increase your response rates, booking rates, and deals close. Plus, they are all white labeled, so you can resell them to your clients. Would you like to know more about how these tools can help your agency? So awesome. Our AI tools are designed to help you streamline your sales process, set you apart from competitors. The AI chatbot, for example, can handle scheduling, managing pipelines, and even answer frequently asked questions, saving you and your team precious time. Plus our AI can generate personalized voice messages image, adding a unique personalized touch to your communication strategy and likely increasing your engagement rates. Does this sound like something that could benefit your agency? Sure. I don't think it could hurt it. Fantastic. Would you like to book an appointment to learn more about how we can benefit your agency? Sure. So the bot is programmed to grab contact information as it, if it doesn't already have it. So for this example, I just put in my phone number and we would like the email address to be able to send the calendar invite via go high level in. So it's going to ask, can I get your email address? I need to send it for the calendar invite for our appointment. So I'll put in, so I'll go ahead and put in my email there, which should update automatically in high level. Boom. Emails there. Now that the bot is recognized that it has the appropriate contact information to send the appointment, it'll begin to find a common time that works for not only your team, giving the available slots on your calendar, but for the lead as well. So thank you, Jordan. Let's find a time that works for you. I have availability October 13th at 7 a.m. to October 13th at 11 p.m. Let me know what time suits you best and I'll send over a calendar invite. So let's say lunch time works best for me because who doesn't love taking meetings at lunch so it's going to confirm there how about we schedule an appointment at 12 30 does that work for you because lunchtime is a broad term we're just going to define it here how about 12 30 does that work sure and look at that the appointment is automatically scheduled and put on the high level calendar and the bot has confirmed it with all the available information 
Great, I've got you scheduled for an appointment at 12.30 tomorrow. I'll send you over a calendar invite to your email. Here's the email, looking forward to our meeting. And if you can see, we go here to the calendar, we go to this calendar, boom, on there, with the contact, with the meeting link, everything, the appointment is now booked. The AI has reached out, qualified, nurtured, and booked the appointment for you all on autopilot. You never had to touch it. So if this sounds interesting and you want AI bots in your agency, not only for you, but for your clients that actually sell, agentcentric.com, sign up for a 14-day trial. Let me know what you think. Talk soon. Thanks so much.